Hi, my name is Andrea Hernandez, and um, I am currently living in Dodge City, Kansas with my husband and my three children. I have a daughter who is 16, um, and then two sons, one who is 13 and one who is 10. Um, so we're at all grade levels, high school, who's also taking concurrent college classes. Um, then I have a son who uh, goes to school with me at the Dodge City Middle School where I am a teacher. And then I have a son still in elementary school. I am currently teaching eighth grade US history at Dodge City Middle School. This is my second year in this position. We moved to Dodge City amid the pandemic during 2020. Um, this was a move for my husband to be back home. Um, so we are back home near his family um, and he is working for the local government. As far as technology, um, it's definitely a love-hate relationship for me. We, if I can get things to work correctly, they work great. But just like getting logged into this class, I had to email the instructor. I sent texts back and forth with um, another one of our classmates already just to even get access to get logged in. Um, so if things work, then technology is great. Um, and the same goes for in the classroom as well. Don't know how many times I've planned to use technology and then the internet's been down or um, I have students, I see 150 kids a day and students don't have their laptops or it's not charged or they broke it in their last class so they don't have one. Then I have students sharing computers. So um, when it works, in the intended manner, I think it's great. Um, I also often struggle, like I said, even just to get logged in. I'm definitely a walk me through it, step-by-step -step sort of person. Um, so once I get comfortable with a platform or something, I like to continue using it. Um, I look forward to definitely getting some new tools to use in the classroom that are both teacher-friendly and student friendly.